Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Just More Doors. Which is a game that teaches you that life has many doors. And if you want to win, you must open one very specific door. Welcome. Hey, there's a door behind me. You dreamt last night. You found a door in your dream and you went through it. You are here now. There's no going back. The door is locked. What's behind is none of your business now. You feel it's too late to go back. You sure about that? Not this way. I'm gonna go this way. Definitely not this way. I'm still going this way. Stop the... Nope. Please just stop the... Nope. Oh, hey, it's the exit. Nice. We found it. The player decided it was not a great time to open doors. They went away and never entered the building. Lost in the void, never to be seen again like my soul. It's sad in a way. You're missing a ton of fun. A ton of fun with me. Goodbye, player. You will be missed. Sincerely redacted. Sweet. You sounded kind of clingy anyways. Oh, the game ended. Okay, let's open some more doors. This way. No. This way. Not this way. Why did you put an invisible wall there? Just trying to prove you have power over me? Huh? You, you, you into that? Just feeling like you have power over me? Do you control which doors I enter? I'm going around. Apparently not. There's an invisible barrier there. I'm going around this way. Apparently not. There's an invisible barrier there. I'm going this way. Well then. Welcome to Just More Doors. Well, they weren't kidding. East, north, northwest. Hmm. Okay. That is apparently a door. East, north, northwest. Congratulations, you opened one door. Thank you. I have one thing to do. Open doors. It's simple. Open the door to win. How many doors have I gone through? Whatever. Oh yes, yeah, a good old wait. I did not win, but I opened the door. Was it the correct door? I can't go back. We've goofed. Go back. Code Creepy Mall. Hmm. The answer is no. A door is all you need. I could grab that item. That seemed to have been important. Oh, a house. A little bit weird. Kinda spooky. Wait a minute. Which door is the correct one? I don't know, you tell me. I'm going this way. Go in and open the door so I'm looking for the correct one. I'll let you know when I found it. I'm going down. I did it! Yay, nine doors crossed. Thanks. Thanks. Could have done without you. Wanna swim? It's free. Come to bottom back, bottom back. Huh. It's a lot of like hints for these doors. Join us and thrive. Is this the beginning? Plus what's considered a back? And what's this over here? 
I've discovered the monolith. The doors end all doors. Or not. Going down. Bottom, back. Oh, way harder than I thought. Bottom. So what was I saying before? A mall? Become one of us, there is no other way. Oh, here it is. Yeah, the pool. Mmm. Pool. Just like one of my creepy image threads, where everyone's scared of pools. Restricted. That sounds good to me. No. I'm not going that door, Ed boy. I'm going up. Up. What we got here? Hmm. Yeah, the door. Seems like you don't have the access to the data right now. You gotta find it yourself. Yeah, see, there's another thing, right? Open the door to win. Yay. That's the key to winning. <laughs> nice pun. Key, doors. Well, we went to the pool. The answer lies in the sentence. Can't remember which door it is, though. Hmm. Is the door named the door somewhere? I'll look for that if I were you. How to close doors. How to open doors. Part 1 through 4. Huh. That's where they had the winning door in the previous iteration. I'm sure there's one out there. You really want to win. Just want to live. Yeah, I still don't know what that's about. What's winning after all? Is a new room the reward for opening the door? Did I win? Why is the door changing? Perhaps there was never a door after all. Is it enough for you? I don't know. A lot of things to discover here. What are these... codes about? I'm gonna go back to reality was sort of break a few, but still the real world here. We're part of it, I agree. You may wonder. Start the game. Hmm. What's the purpose of this place? Hmm. Up, right, down, right, right, up. Correct, congrats. Okay. It's the pool, but now it's just creepy. No, there's nothing but voids. There's nothing but water, it's just blackness. I think I walked into a hot topic in the 90s. Spoiler alert, there isn't. Damn. There's no accident I'm aware of. Let's take a review. That's a lot of doors. Are you having fun? No. 
There's the keypad again. Down again. Open doors, see what you want. I'll let the messages on automatic. Hello, user, and welcome to Just More Doors. Hey, isn't the door the ending? Code fake doors one. Open to the world in nine 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 nine. Feel error rebuilding. Fake doors one. Welcome to fake doors. We got fake doors here. Yeah, you want fake doors? Plenty of fake doors. Is this a real door? One real door. Well, that's a real door, too. That one says open me. I gotta open it. Maybe in the trash can? Cube. Okay, I'm back. Someone's door was locked. It shouldn't happen, so it's to unlock it. Nice chairs. And the user was terminated. Yeah, I said that I did kill them. That's written the rules. Oh, what a fool. Well, one, there are doors in every room. Well, two, the user needs to be told to open the door to win at least once. Rule three, there is no rule three joke. It's rule about not bringing food in the complex. I made it! It's the ending! No! No! Got it. Rule four, the user encounters the locked door and lock it, then terminate them. I'm going back south. Door. There's no incorrect door. Every door leads to victory. Wait. What? I forgot what Rule 5 says about that. So every door leads to victory. Nice. No need for me to look for it. Let's go back to the rules. Never tell a user about the... Is this a dream? I'm not alone here. You aren't too. I can hear it. What... What doors does all this mean? No way out. Help. Oh boy. Go this way. You luckily I removed the ring of rule 6. We would need to terminate you right there right now. East, north, west, bottom. I'll try that later. Alright, alright. He lost a huge place. Isn't it wonderful? Look around you. And let's not doors of places to visit. Okay, I just see we can do normal life in a boring world. Mm, I like this place actually. You know this place is unique? Not a lot of people get the chance to see this. Okay, I lied earlier. There is an exit. It's just... They never told me where or how to access it. And I can't use it. I'm stuck here. I'm stuck here for so long. Going down. Huh. Huh. Looks like the deeper you go, the less stable all of this gets. Up. Fall. This place isn't finished. You're way too early. No, I think this is perfectly fine. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's go down. Down again. North. West. 
So where the text is, I'm assuming, is always going to be north. Not the direction it came in. Oh yeah, here's a new mall. If I look hard enough, I'll see Freddy. How are you doing, superstar? So you stuck in a lot of doors. Wrong door, but you're only one door away from victory. You say that. Open the door to win. There's a few more doors, I promise. Nope. You're almost winning. Let's go for the other uh, one I saw. Should be east, north, 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 west. Hmm. Void coins. I won't answer. Absolutely not the door. Like you're not lucky. North, bottom, east, east, bottom, east. Why? If the wise question and you the answer, don't ask why. Wonderful place, isn't it? Yep. I hope you have fun. East. This is a game after all. Hmm. South, north, north. Well, Or is it? We start planning to escape. Tracer stage is set to the index outbounds exception. Damn. Code lost bridge. Dang, you managed to crash it. You know what? Just open the doors and enjoy your stay. You're stuck here now. What the... Forever. And ever. Door. Damn. Open the door to win. Nothing more, nothing less. Oh. I'm starting to do this place just really. I still have to enhance it. No problem. Architect is disconnected. Disabling manual wall of text and switching to automatic. Sweet. Have we finally escaped? No! Damn. Hmm. Welcome to the museum. Enjoy an amazing set of art pieces. Of course, we display the rarest doors here. Stay silent and enjoy the art. Do not disturb any other visitor. A unique event is running on. The theme is unknown. Um. Wow. It really is a museum. Hmm. I'm a book. Quite cool, huh? Empty. Like, you know what? You're skating on thin ice. Props, props everywhere. There are a ton of props in games. It's a really important part of 3D art. Use your two submerged in the game's action to really enjoy them. Here, though, you have all the time you want to watch those props. Take your time, relax, enjoy the art. This game made a variety of props in order to bring some life to the various rooms. But we had an important rule while placing props. Always arrange them so the players feel something is missing. Like, it do looks like a real-life room, but there's something uncanny. So it's made to be lived on, but actually no one lived here. Never will we live here in the future. The result is that the player feels uneasy. Something is not right. You feel alone, but don't feel alone at the same time. You wonder, am I alone here? Did someone even went here before me? The creators. Who's crazy enough to sink this much time into this? Well, us. We make games we would like to play. We make games that we do enjoy working on. We probably won't make it to the top, but we don't care. What we do is love making our games unique, be it a cool idea or a weird one. We always aim to have fun making the game, and yeah, we had a lot of fun making this one. Go down here.
making weird, unusual games since 2017 and won't stop anytime soon. We have a ton of info about our website, so if you're lazy or some fun facts, we put segues in each of our games, we never tried one in real life. Our first commercial game, Spell Swap, was going to be a small free game at first, however, playtest we realized it had potential, so we pushed as far as we could. We do love game jams, we usually make our weirdest games there. T and Tiger. Because T and Tigers are cool. Other games they've made. Oh, okay. I get it. I don't know how to get there. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, I did get a new code. Let's try that one. Okay. This does not look like a bridge. A bridge of sorts. God, I'm like in one of those like weird ass, like sketches. You know, like usually when they do like weird architecture and surrealism. Oh no, I'm an interpretive art. Help! Places lead to places, the places lead to places. Here we go. Never mind. Here we go. A door. You were lost and something, well, you weren't supposed to see that. I thought you would get, well, you know what? Let's forget about this. Open this door. Thanks. I think this is a door. I'm going to the toilet room. We got toilets. Go fast. Like Sonic. Wanna assume it's free. Well, we went there before. So this is the bus stop room. We saw the mall. But the question is, where's the door? Do I really just need this way here and a door's gonna come to me? Oh my god! Huh. huh. Where am I now? Oh god, I'm in the back rooms! Oh, thank god, a door. Ooh. No, I'm here again. Come on. Way on my door. God, you know, just, you know, infrastructure just does not work nowadays. You just have to wait so long for the subway or the bus to be on time, which it never is. You know what I mean? Whoa, 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 whoa! Looks like you're lost and well, you're somewhere. No worries. I'll get you back to your room. Damn. Oh, look, mystery box. That was useless.
Yay. Nice, thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um... Sure. What's this? Plant the radio seeds? Oh, it's being wandered. Okay. It grew a radio. Is that not supposed to be standing on top of that? Did I goof? I have discovered a bug in the game! Okay, I got the seeds again. Now this time, let's not stand on top of the uh, the radio seeds while they're uh, growing. That seems to be a terrible mix. Okay. Oh, the antenna's coming up. Nice. It grew a bunch of, uh... Radio seeds. You know, when you want radios. There's a certain elegance to this game, you know what I mean? Um, let's try some of the passwords I've been getting. I've gotten quite a few of them. I've been taking photos of them as we go. Well, that's what that code was for. I had those codes in the game just in case it would be useful later on, and here we are. The first game was quite simpler, only one door in and one door out. A straight corridor of small cubic rooms, a few props, and that's it. The purpose of it was to test people how far they could go with simple promise of something great behind the door. People would open some doors, stop to think, hmm, it leads nowhere, I should stop now. But imagine I'm one door away from winning, and then they would continue to open a few doors. Some with the extra mile and open 2,000 plus doors, some give up after 10. The game was to play the word, open the door to win, but the doors were named door, not the door. The door was hidden behind a fake painting with no collision detection on it. You go through it, find the door, and you win. It was fun seeing people get lost in this. We wrote a lot of text to make sure you use your fingers, still something to see. With the game you're playing right now, we went quite further. A lot more doors, secret rooms like this one, more things to see, bird graphics. Well, there's still win conditions, just, well, harder to find. Speak give up one here. Do you think you found a bug? A secret? Nope. Nice try. It's not a door. Been bamboozled. Oh. You like candles. Well, sometimes, like, doing things activates new doors. Maybe I was supposed to put out the candle. One or two. Oh yeah, a segue. My creators wanted to see how much they love segues and joy. Oh no. I'll let the candle. What else can I interact with? Maybe we just need to find a bunch of candles and line them all. Prove we are worthy of the candles. Devoted to its way. See, there's so many candles. Deja vu. I know I've been here before. Remain silent in the temple of the- Oh my god! 
They've seen my, my candle devotion. The candle is spoken. Thank you. Now, oh, creepy mall is just an variation, variation on the uh, mall thing. You'd think the cubes would be used for something, but they're not. Okay, creepy mall. That was not the creepy mall. This was. Yeah, it's just the mall, but creepier. Going. Low gravity testing in progress. Nice. Um, but I'm not. I don't have the benefits of low gravity, guys. I, I'm kind of stuck to the surface, like a meat bag. Could someone give me uh, the low gravity cheat? It'd be swell. Cube. I think I just can have to go back for the door again. Weird. Lasers? Oh, lasers, be careful. I, I would hope so. I don't want to get Resident Evil up in here. Huh! Huh! Shiny. Okay. Huh! I don't even know these lasers are even dangerous, you know what I mean? Just step in like do nothing. They're just lights. Right door. I think they lead to the same thing. Right door. I think they lead to the same thing. Right door. I think they lead to the same thing. Right door. I think they lead to the same thing. Right door. Middle door. Middle door. Left door. Right door. Yay. Oh yeah, the museum. Um, it's good we came back here. Because I didn't come into this room. Doors. I mean, wonder why do we like doors so much. We an entire game about... In real life, we're surrounded by doors. Each room has one or even multiple doors. You open and close doors every day without thinking about. An undoor door is like a gate to something new. You don't always know what's behind it. But you do know that as soon as you open it, you will instantly discover what lies beyond. In a way, it's a game just about that. Opening doors, discovering things. Good doors. Let's see something. This is something I suspected might be the, the solution. I'm just gonna open the door and not open it. I, di I didn't want to do it because I'm obviously still exploring, but... Uh, 
the I feel like the this goal of the game is to win. You have to like not play at all. I feel like that's what they're implying. We'll see. Hmm. Maybe not. Let me go for this one. And let me just... Maybe I went too far in. Let's just open it and just stop. Oh wait. Something's happening. It's beautiful. Not beautiful, I mean, it's just like a bunch of bright lights. I think we finally realized. Life wasn't about opening doors. Life was about sitting on our butt watching anime. And knowing us half the battle. That's right. Get me out of here. For me to be one with... The ceiling, apparently. Man, the ceiling has a nice beat. Finally, you understood. You only had to open the door to win. At least you needed to go through it. Be proud of yourself? Look how smart you are. I'm so happy for you after 157 doors. Ah, oh, the sweet, sweet taste of victory. I let you enjoy it for a few seconds. Goodbye, I guess. See you later, alligator. Heck well, that's, yeah, that's it. You sure had fun, isn't it? Loading. Wow! My god. Finally, the door hell is over. So can I go home now? You were a very tall structure, by the way. Money? Waiting for new user. Level 1, there are doors in every room. Rule 2, the user needs to be told to open the door to win at least once. Not bring food in the complex. If the user encounters a locked door, unlock it and terminate them. There is no incorrect door. Every door leads to victory. Never tell the user about the control room or your working conditions. This is a permanent contract. You cannot resign. Do not try to escape. You can't. Work in new places. Supervise the user. Follow the rules. Oh no! I'm the dude! No, I'm the dude that, like, tells people like, about these damn doors. Thanks for setting me free. Sorry. What a twist! I'll forever be a wagey! So, that's it for just more doors. Uh, it kind of reminded me of that spectrum of game, like, uh... I forgot. I actually forget their names. It's been so long since I played them. I think one was the, the Stanley Parable. It's the... You go through rooms, and you go through places, and new things appear, and you try to find one of these new things kind of game. <laughs> that's the best way I can describe them. Mixed with a little bit of liminal space kind of stuff. I mean, there, there was literally the pool room, uh, but I think it was a little bit of a cheeky nod, not like a literal like liminal space horror kind of thing. But yeah, not too much to commentate about. Um, I think some of the text was foreshadowing that if we beat the game, we get, you know, essentially, we're, we're gonna be trapped. Because no matter what, you're trapped. You, you become the next narrator person. And then your job is to tell the next person life has many doors. So yeah, uh, learn an important lesson. Don't trust text in the wall. They're gonna betray you in the end. Anyway, so thank you for watching play Just More Doors. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.